So in this video, we'll be seeing how to create the storage sections for the already created storage types. So far, the org structure, what we have created is um, under the plant and the storage location, we have created the warehouse structure as warehouse number, which is a three digit alphanumeric key. Then we have created the storage type, which is again three digit alphanumeric key. Um, however, we have created um, the storage type, the create the storage sections under the storage types. Now, one of the mandatory fact over here is that every storage type must have one storage section at the least okay that is very important so you can have more than one however one is mandatory so let's go and let's create the storage sections so we go inside now our warehouse number was uc3 storage type the one that we created was tpt now you can see there is no entry as such so we'll be creating a new entry warehouse number is uc3 then storage type as TBT and then we will be creating the section as 001 and we will say that this is a total section. So here this is now created. Now if in case you want one more you can create one more which is like if in case you have fast moving goods, slow moving goods you can do that always on the basis of the fast and the slow moving goods. So let me say 002 and then we will say slow moving goods okay and then just save it so now we have created the warehouse number which is a three digit three digit alpha numeric key then we have created storage type then we have created a storage section under it so all of them they are like three digit alpha numeric keys all right now the next one is a storage bins which would be kept at the section level storage section level and storage bin is considered to be the master data under the warehouse where the stock is actually kept now these storage bins these are 10 digit in general and the actual there either you can define the coordinates or you can define um, the way business wants it however the maximum character that you can denote for a storage bin it is 10 digits all right so in the upcoming video we'll be seeing how to create the storage bins thank you so much for watching